Hello and welcome to Programming the Lazy Way, a sequence of short videos for beginning programmers and beyond. I'm Will Briggs, creator of C++ for Lazy Programmers, and that's what I want to talk about today. Why we should have fun when learning to program and how I can help. If you really want to learn to program, think about how you're going to get good at it. Will you be a better programmer if everything's kind of dull, you don't really like it, and it feels like work? Or if you can't wait to get started because it's so much fun. The answer to that one's obvious, isn't it? So I say if you want to enjoy yourself, you should enjoy yourself. If you want to be serious and get ready for real programming, you should still enjoy yourself. My approach in C++ for lazy programmers is to do different things, often but not always involving games and graphics. You can start out by making simple line drawings. That's in chapter one. In the next chapter, Maybe you'll do a slideshow with lyrics from your favorite song. Or take your flamingo or your yard gnome on a vacation around the world. And as you can see from me going back and forth, this works in both the Unix world or in Microsoft Windows with Visual Studio and also with MinGW, which uses G++ on a Windows platform. Here's a hidden object game from Chapter 4, Click the Items to Win. By Chapter 12, you're ready for a full arcade game with collisions, sound, event handling, latency, and real-time keyboard and mouse interaction. The focus in all this is getting a firm understanding of the basics of the language, variables, loops, arrays, functions, and designing algorithms in the first 12 chapters, and then in the next 12 ish, adding nice goodies that make C++ so good at organization, classes, templates, exceptions, and the standard template library. Along the way, you'll get an understanding of the foundational data structures, stacks, queues, and linked lists that you'll need to go further. At the end, you get extras to help you move beyond merely competent programmer to expert. Instructions on how to make your own libraries. I've never seen that in an intro textbook, but maybe I've missed something. The use of smart pointers, lambda expressions, and more. I've been teaching new programmers in C++ for decades and have been refining this book for more than a decade. You can get a free preview at Amazon. Please leave your comments below, subscribe to this or my Facebook group or page for more tips, and stay lazy.